Welcome to Sound Awesome Films, I'm Rob. Before we do the multi-target assassination, we're going to invest in Debonair. We're going to put all our money into it with all three characters. So swap between the characters and invest in Debonair because we're about to make a buttload of money. Uh, not off Debonair though. This is just like a little bonus extra money. We're going to make a crap ton of money off the company uh, who we're screwing over. I know, pretty good, huh? Alright, so now, we have four targets to take out. Let's do a send us a message. Tell us where it is. Great. Delete the message, because he asked us to. Because we're nice like that. He doesn't ask us to delete, delete the next ones, though. So, that's your mistake, Lester. I might keep them. Alright, so we've got to take out the jurors. So, Redwood Cigarettes is in trouble, uh, because they're cigarettes, and they, you know, people smoke them, they die. Simple as that. Logic. Uh, so, they, uh, they're on trial. And they've paid off, uh, Redwood have paid off four different jurors. And they're like, oh, well, you know, with the four jurors, we're going to get away with this one. Bullshit, you are going down and you're going to lose a lot of money. And we're going to make damn sure because we're going to kill those four jurors. The first one being a muscle head out in the, uh, out on the beach here. Of course, you know, some gym junkie can easily be bought off. They're not exactly the smartest thing. You say you want money? Oh yeah, I'll take money. I mean, look at fucking Stallone's career. How many movies have he has he made that have been actually good? Like The Expendables. You can't tell me that's not like someone said. Hey, you want to make a lot of money off some, you know, nostalgia? He'd be like, oh yeah, I'd, I'd take the money. Yeah, we're gonna take this motherfucker out. Look at that beefcake man. You know what? I could go down there and fist fight them, and I reckon I'd win. Yeah, counter attacks easy but that guy was huge now he's dead so he's not that big he's dead so who cares right number two uh he's on the yacht head north yacht there's a yacht club i think all right let's go to the yacht club take out the juror let's cruise all right when you go around here he's not too far is it he must be at the ocean then so we don't need to follow the road we can just stick to the uh can i make it through here you're lucky, buddy. If I didn't put that on, I would probably killed you. Though you did have a helmet on, so I probably would have disabled you, and your brain would be stuck in your head, nice and safe. Or a very bad concussion as it bounced around your skull. That's what happens. Oh, this guy, you're lucky too. I think that's exactly the same guy. Oh, yeah. This is what happens when you're on the wrong side of the road. Danger. Ooh. I think that lady's dead. I'm sorry. Might have been a man too. Alright, well, I'm just trying to, you know... Be, uh, I don't want to be suspicious or anything. No one would recognize, no one would be, you know, someone gets murdered out here. They're like, oh man, there's a serious murder over there. Did you see anything weird? Just a car driving on the wrong side of the lane. Oh man, great. Perfect. Well done, Franklin. You are clearly the best driver in the game. Where are we going? I see shit up there. What if I go up there? Alright, let's go up there. Here we go. da 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 so, uh, this one has gold requirements, and we're going to meet them all. I can't remember exactly what they are at the moment. I know it's just a, I think it's just a time limit, which we have six minutes to take these guys out. There he is. He's out in the boat. Why would you not just point me in that direction to start with? Right, so it's not the lady. It's the Mr. Man. I'm pretty sure we killed the lady, too, because I have a really good snap rifle. I'm going to steal this car. Yeah, you better run. You didn't see shit. Where are you? We know his description to the cops gonna be. Did you see anything? Yeah, I saw a black guy shoot him. Narrows it down in this state. Los Santos is a dangerous place. Ballers and shit everywhere. Right now we've got third juror. There's a cop up there. I'm gonna go around him. Get behind him. Nah, he spotted me. Whatever. That's fine. Right, we have to go far left. I need to get off this road. It has a perfect exit. You gonna cut me off? Yeah, that's right. Whoa. Who puts a sign there like that? That's dangerous. Alright, so let's take out juror number three. Ding, ding, ding. Let's cut across here. Fuck that. Follow the curvy road when you can take a shortcut. A good one. We didn't muck up our car or anything. Fantastic. We're going to make a shit ton of money. This one. Uh, I invested about $2.4 million uh, into this. Into Debonair. Which I'm going to... Uh, I reckon I can make that into five. And then that five, I want to turn into a crap ton of money. So, let's see how we go. So this is the this is how we manipulate the stock market, people. 
And we're doing a damn good job. So we're gonna drive to jury number four. Or three. Number three. Number four is a dude in the black. He's pretty easy. Whoa, yeah, that's good. Whoa, that was nice. Well done, Franklin. Gun it through here. I like Franklin's ability. I just wish it was easy to turn it on. You kind of have to abandon your controls for a little bit to push them both in. Oh, yeah. That's fine. We're almost there. So who are we taking out now? Number three, who are you? I think Lester said he's on dirty windows. So he must be the... There he is. Window washer right there. Let's pull over. Pull out our sniper. We have heaps of time left. Take aim. In the head because we feel hey, like it. Hopefully no one else was in that building. Because that would like scare the shit out of him. Some guy's brains just splatter. And if the bullet went through, they could have killed someone else. Alright. Got a GPS. We got a biker. That's fine. Let's take him out. Put your phone away, Franklin. You're driving, buddy. It's dangerous. I always get the urge. I try to avoid it. I always get the urge. Whenever I see a guy on a bike or a quad bike, it's hard not to hit him just because you want to see him fly in the air. I cannot be the only one. He was always tempted to do that. But there's nice turning, Franklin. Get some speed around here. This guy is quite... He's 0.8 miles away. And he's driving so he can get further away. Though he's not driving as fast as us. Unless we crash, then in which case he'll be driving faster than us. And we'll probably die because Franklin never wears his friggin' seatbelt. Seriously, what is with this character? Every... I hate... I'm not racist. But I hate playing as Franklin. For... Not because, you know, I'm a white person and he's black or anything like that. It's just that he never wears his seatbelt. Never. I can crash as Michael and Trevor. That's fine. You know? But every fucking crash I have with Franklin, he flies out the window. Why does he not wear his seatbelts? That was it. See, that what happened there was I tried to do my focus. Instead, I looked behind me. Didn't help. Didn't help. Gotta push those buttons at the same time. Alright, we got a biker. Where is he? Oh, he's riding. He's on the he's on the move. He must have been buying oranges. Probably for his lady. She probably said, go out, get me some oranges. And he's like, yeah, sure. I can afford it now because I'm getting paid off. And guess what, buddy? You're about to die once I get out of this tree. All right, there he is. Franklin has a Franklin is really good at slow-mo shooting because we can slow down. And then we can just start picking him off. Because we all know driving and shooting is kind of the, sh the weakest link in Grand Theft Auto. But uh, now we've knocked them off. Oh, no, nah, I won't. I won't do it. I thought about it. You guys are lucky. I thought about it. I don't want Franklin to fly out the friggin' window as usual. Alright, we have done. Mission passed. Time taken. Speed killer bonus. And we got to earn some money. Now, let's sell our debonair stocks and see how much money we make. So, we'll go to our markets, my portfolio. Debonair. So we have about two million worth. Or that's profit. So now we sell it. And we go for it. Continue. So we just made another extra two million. So we've got four point four million dollars. Which is very nice. Now we're going to invest that money back into Redwood. Because you can see Redwood has tanked. They are incredibly cheap. And you can see that high and low is usually about 183 to 270. To 49, that's going to bounce back up to about 183 anyway. So if we invest all our money back into Redwood, uh, right now they're down, sure. So we're going to take advantage of this decline. And then uh, when, we're going to wait. It's going to take a couple of days. So it's not going to be instant. So now we have $2 to our name to last for a couple of days. But uh, once the days have passed, we can see Redwood has bounced back. And we can make a crap ton of money. So now if we sell our stocks, we've put about $4 million into Redwood. And now if we sell it, and we go sell all, how much money have we made? Get ready. It's going to be a lot. I know you're excited. So uh, right now they're at 196 and we bought them at 49 So if we sell them, we're going to make $17 million. 